On foreign policy, there's another issue, and I wish I could come before you and tell you that I have a magical solution. I don't. And that is, for decades now, there has been hatred and warfare in the Middle East. Everybody knows that we've had some presidents, Carter, Clinton, others, who have tried to do their best to resolve it. All I can tell you is I will make every single effort to bring rational people on both sides together so that hopefully we can have, through a level playing field, the United States treating everybody in that region equally, hopefully, and I know, I know that there are people of goodwill in Israel and in the Arab communities. This is not an easy task, but it is a task that we must pursue. We cannot continue to have for another 60 years the kind of hatred and conflict that exists in the Middle East. Hatred <laughs> and warfare in the Middle East. Everybody knows that we've had some presidents, Carter, Clinton, others, who have tried to do their best to resolve it. All I can tell you is I will make every Arab communities this is not an easy task, but it is a task that we must pursue. We cannot continue to have for another 60 years the kind of hatred and conflict equally. Hopefully, and I know, I know that there are people of goodwill in Israel and in the single effort to bring rational people on both sides together so that hopefully we can have, through a level playing field, the United States treating everybody in that region equal. On foreign policy, there's another issue, and I wish I could come before you and tell you that I have a magical solution. I don't. And that is, for decades now, there has been hate.